page 43. This is lesson number four. Page four, three. Who is Jesus Christ? Jesus Christ is the Son of God. Jesus is God's greatest gift to us. We call Jesus Christ because Jesus was sent by God the Father. Jesus is always with us in the church. Jesus lives with the Father and the Holy Spirit in heaven. Jesus wants us to live in heaven forever too. Heaven is the spirit world. Heaven is being forever with God. Turn the page. Page 44. Four, four. God chose Mary to be the mother of Jesus. God sent an angel to Mary. Angels are special beings who serve God forever. They are invisible, but they are real. The angel told Mary that God chose her to be the mother of his son. Mary did not understand how she could give birth to God's son. But Mary loved God and trusted God. She wanted to serve God. She was willing to do whatever God asked. Mary said yes to God. God sent the Holy Spirit to Mary. The Holy Spirit remained in Mary and helped prepare her to be Jesus' mother. We call Mary the mother of God because she gave birth to Jesus, and Jesus is God. We are blessed that God chose Mary. We are blessed that Mary said yes to God. Mary is truly the mother of God. Next page. Page 45. The Bible tells us that Mary was away from home when Jesus was born. Jesus was born in a stable. A stable is a place where animals are sheltered from bad weather. It was the only place that Mary and her husband, Joseph, could find to rest. Mary and Joseph named the newborn baby Jesus. The name Jesus means God saves. Mary took care of Jesus the same way someone took care of you when you were born. Mary held Jesus. She fed him. She kept him warm. Turn the page. Page 46. 4, 6. Jesus is God's only Son. Jesus is the second person of the Blessed Trinity. God the Father sent God the Son, Jesus. This happened by the power of the Holy Spirit. The Son of God came to live with us. He became like you and me, but he was still God. Jesus was God the Father's only Son. There have been many people in the world, but Jesus is the only Son of God. We also call Jesus the name Christ. Christ is a word that means the anointed one or the chosen one, the one chosen by God. We also call Jesus the Messiah. God sent us Jesus Christ to save us. Jesus is part of God's promise to love us always. Next page. Page 47. Jesus gives us new life. Jesus shows us that we can live with God forever. Jesus came to give us new life with God. The Bible tells us that Jesus said, I came so that they might have life. 
In Jesus, God came to live with us as a person, like us. People are special to God. The birth of Jesus shows how much God loves us. Jesus lived in our world for about 33 years. He helped people and he healed people. He forgave people who had disobeyed God's laws. He taught people about God and how to be happy with God forever. Jesus gave his life for us. He died on the cross out of love for us. He rose from the dead. Now he lives forever with his Father and the Holy Spirit. All these things were part of God's plan for us. God sent Jesus out of love for us. Turn the page. Page 48. Four, eight. Jesus lives with his Father and the Holy Spirit in heaven. After Jesus rose from the dead, Jesus returned to his Father. Jesus lives with God the Father and God the Holy Spirit in heaven. Heaven is life forever with God. Think about something that makes you very happy. God wants us to be even happier than that. God wants us to be happier than we can imagine. God wants us to live with him forever in heaven. Jesus shows us that we can. On page 49, there's a review. I'll give you the answers. Mary is the mother of Jesus. An angel told Mary that God wanted her to be the mother of his son. Heaven is happiness with God forever.